I looked at it too. I was like, wait, is that the right? Is that the right one? Do you mind if I just? No. There you go. Thank you so much. <laughs> The blondes came on the scene a few years back and immediately I was just like, who are these girls? I wanna know these girls, I wanna ride with these girls. The main problem with the blondes is they need a fourth blonde. Me, Amy, hi, can I come in, please? <laughs> they never really take it too seriously, which I think a lot of people can do and it ends up being detrimental to the whole point because you're just skiing, you know? It's supposed to be fun and they definitely seem to be having more fun than most. So the blondes are three ladies that ski together and we met in Revelstoke five years ago. Decided to get snowmobiles and explore the backcountry together. We call ourselves the blondes not because of the hair color but because of the beer. <laughs> we were drinking some beers. We were like maybe we can get them to send us beer and we can be the blondes. And they sent us a couple beers, and then we asked for some more beers, and they're like, no, <laughs> you shouldn't drink more beers. It's not all about the hair color. It's also about <laughs> having a good time. We do our contour, we do our makeup, we do our hair. Yeah. Emily is one of the coolest, raddest, incredibly driven, confident humans I've had the pleasure of meeting. She loves to ski as much as possible. She's a helicopter pilot. A helicopter pilot. I think the first time I met her, we were skiing the hill together. And then I look over and Emily's just on top of the cliff, just flying off. I'm like, okay, we're gonna be great friends. <laughs> Tanya is an incredibly driven, hardcore, badass Norwegian woman. And <laughs> just has this Norwegian send to her. <laughs> You don't see in many people. <laughs> Janelle is such a kind girl and she's always down to have fun. Fun to learn from and she's always down to try stuff. She has the park mentality when she goes into the backcountry, which is so awesome. Janelle's a handful, for sure. <laughs> No, she's like the best. I wouldn't want another ski partner. She's awesome. My ski of choice is the Bent 120. It skis good on slush, on groomers, and I just like the way it's so surfy. And even in the park, it's kind of fun. You know, I watch the blondes ski, and they have like this fire to their skiing, and like they push each other and they're all riding the Ben Chetler. I know for me, that ski gave me so much confidence trying new things and progressing, and I think that those girls just took the Ben Chetler and were like, we're gonna change our skiing. I think the blondes are doing something really amazing for the sport and for women in skiing and just showing their real, raw personalities as they are. I love seeing the progression that women are putting out there when they're on their skis in the mountains. I've always known that women are capable of these amazing things, but it's really cool and exciting to kind of be seeing the really big exponential upswing in women's progression right now.